أشهد أن محمد رسول الله 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 loves you all and by Allah Allah wants خير for you and by Allah Allah wants to see you in Jannah the question is do you want to see Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in Jannah indeed the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said in the authentic hadith man ahabba liqa Allah ahabba Allah liqa'ah wa man kariha liqa Allah kariha Allah liqa'ah whoever loves to meet Allah Allah loves to meet him and whoever hates to meet Allah Allah hates to meet him ask yourself are you from those people my brothers and my sisters in Islam my brothers and my sisters in Islam one day the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam stood up in the depths of the night it is authentically reported in Al-Bukhari that he raised his hands up to the heavens and he said, Oh Allah, my Ummah, my Ummah, Ya Allah, my Ummah, my Ummah, Ya Allah, my Ummah, my Ummah. He couldn't say more than that. He couldn't finish his sentences because he was so emotional until the night passed and the last third of the night came until Fajr time came. And at that point, Jibreel alayhi salatu wasalam came down and said, Ya Muhammad, Ya Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, Allah has sent me and said, Ya Muhammad, your Lord will not disappoint you regarding your ummah. Your Lord will not disappoint you regarding your ummah. The question is, brothers and sisters of Islam, are we going to disappoint our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam? Are we going to disappoint our Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam? Allah has promised our Prophet, He will not disappoint him regarding our ummah. The question is us, are we going to otherwise not fulfill the promise of Allah and be a disappointment for a Prophet Be you of those people who fulfill his vision. Be you of those people who fulfill your love for Allah but pursuing the vision of Rasulullah on this earth.